And for those of you trying to get your first dunk, I would emulate this. Yup, another day, another dunk, and that's how I'm keeping it up. Living high one day at a time, and every day's a battle to never give up. Strength phase going strong, pun intended, and it seems as if my path just got extended. But where I'm headed just got more clear, more directed, more mapped out, as if someone just gave me the blueprint. Now all I need is patience, consistency, so I'm focused on building my resilience. Ten years in and I'm just getting started. Mastery is a never-ending journey. A chance to chase your higher self. And I'm forever closing in. The higher my goals, the deeper I go within. <laughs> Energy's feeling amazing. It's warm in here. Woke up with my HRV through the roof. Been lifting like crazy, a little less this week, heavier and a little less set, so I think I'm a little more fresh. Just focus on building a huge strength base, and if you watched my last vlog, I talked about building resilience. That's my mood right now, that's my focus long, long term, because I feel like the stronger I get, the more foundation I've built, and the longer I can make progress, and the higher I can jump. Focus today is max jumps, stimulating that max jump, just throw lobs and go get it. Because I'm really heavy in the lifting phase, I don't have many jumps in me today, so I'm not really fo focused on dribble dunks or trick dunks. I'm really just focused on footwork technique and max jumping. Oh. 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 Thanks for staying along with the journey though. Oh, God. The grass is feeling explosive, and I feel like I'm just scratching the surface, not just for today, but my potential, because I'm lifting so much. I literally lifted 9,000 pounds yesterday. Also gonna measure it to double check, because it's listed at 10 feet, but every fraction counts. It's like one eighth under 10 feet. It's literally like the one notch of a thing. I don't know what to call these uh, millimeters. No, that's uh, it's a fraction of an inch. We don't have words for that. We're dumb. We should use meters. It's probably like one centimeter, two centimeters under 10 feet. What? <laughs> Methodical and strong. And I'm just, I feel like I'm using just two giant big steps and it feels really good to have all that power. Oh! Not bad for the first try. I want to punch it, it was okay. But I'm happy first try, I didn't really, I mean, I'm, I'm what the, it's all about the bang. There's no emphasis if you don't yam it, so everything has to be yammed or it's kind of no hype. Smash it. That's an inch and a half high. Exactly 10 feet now. Good thing I brought this. So honestly, I really feel like I'm barely dunking because it's legit 10 feet and I have to try so hard just to dunk it. Yes, I have room to spare and a little bit of distance, but it's not its not as much room or, or like next level. I feel like I'm barely dunking for me because it's been so long, but I feel amazing. It's actually the best I could have asked for because my body's banged up a little bit, but still feeling super strong and good bounce, effortless bounce, even the dribble dunk, most of my hand over the rim. And that's my weakness. So for that to be strong feels great. A little over 10-3. This would probably be the highest I've ever dunked. So this height for me is basically the same as training for my first dunk. So I'm going to throw some lobs, try to get the perfect timing, but most importantly, jump as hard as I possibly can. For those of you trying to get your first dunk, I would emulate this. Yo, just want to say thank you for all the love and support along this journey. So much more to come, not just for my dunk journey, but for my channel. So I'm excited. Let me know what you want to see for Dunk Tip Tuesday. This week I just squatted a PR today, 325. I don't think I've ever put that much weight on my back for a full squat and it was easy. So let's get to it. I'm pumped for the future and I can't wait to show you guys what I can do. It just, it never ends. It just never ends. Let's go.
And lastly, if you want to start your dunk journey, I got programs from beginner to intermediate to my entire instant jump tech program, six weeks to master your technique. Plus I have personal coaching from reviews of your jump technique to one-on-one -on -one coaching. So hit me up on my website. Let's work, baby. Ah! I'm also a rapper.